Welcome back to Rankum, folks. We're thrilled to have you here with us today. Today, we're talking about America's team, the Dallas Cowboys. That's right, the team with the storied history and a legacy that spans decades. We're building an all-time Texas team, position by position, and let me tell you something, this is no easy feat. Each player has left an indelible mark on the game, so buckle up, because we're about to dive deep into Cowboys history and crown the ultimate Texas squad. From legendary plays to unforgettable moments, we've got it all. Get ready to hear some names you know, and maybe a few that'll surprise you. This journey through time will showcase the best of the best, and you won't want to miss a second of it. First up, we gotta talk about the man who built the Cowboys into America's team. We talking about the legendary Tom Landry from Mission, Texas. Five Super Bowl appearances, two Lombardi trophies, and a record 20 straight winning seasons. That's dominance, folks. Now, let's talk quarterbacks. Dandy Don Meredith was a two-time All-American at SMU and the first player ever signed by the Cowboys. Meredith was the face of the franchise in its early years, leading them to three Pro Bowls and winning the Burt Bell Award in 1966. Now, let's talk about the running back position. For longevity, you gotta go with Robert Newhouse from Hallsville. He played all 12 seasons with the Cowboys, went to three Super Bowls, winning one, and he's still sixth on the Cowboys' all-time rushing list. Now, Let's talk about a position that doesn't get enough love these days. Fullback. Walt Garrison was a real-life cowboy. He played nine seasons in Dallas, never had a losing record, and won Super Bowl VI. Garrison was a punishing blocker, a tough runner, and a true original. Now, let's talk wide receivers. And we gotta start with one of the most electrifying players in Cowboys history, Des Bryant. Dez was a problem for opposing defenses. He was big, fast, had incredible hands, and played with a certain fire and passion. All right, we got another wide receiver spot to fill, and we're staying in the Lone Star State for this one. Texas has always been a breeding ground for football talent. C.D. Lamb might have been born in Louisiana, but he got to Houston as fast as he could. Houston embraced him, and he embraced Houston right back. This kid was unstoppable at Foster High School, putting up ridiculous numbers. He was a local legend before he even graduated. He's already a three-time Pro Bowler and an All-Pro, showcasing his elite skills on the biggest stages, and he's just getting started. The sky's the limit for C.D. Lamb, and we can't wait to see what he does next. Now, let's move on to the tight end position. When it comes to offensive firepower, the nod has to go to Martellus Bennett, another Houston product. Bennett was a matchup nightmare for defenses, and he was a key part of the Cowboys' offense during his four seasons in Dallas. Now, let's talk about the big boys up front, starting with the center position. Andre Garodi was a second-round pick out of the University of Houston and became a mainstay on the Cowboys' offensive line. Gerode was a five-time Pro Bowler, anchoring that offensive line for years. Now, let's move on to the guard position. Leonard Davis was an absolute mountain of a man, a three-time Pro Bowler known for his incredible strength and athleticism. All right, we need another guard for this all-Texas team, and we're going back to East Texas for this one. Mark Tuane, from Longview, Texas, played 15 seasons in Dallas, protecting the likes of Troy Aikman and Emmett Smith. All right, we're moving on to the tackle position, and we got to start with one of the most dominant offensive linemen in NFL history, Forrest Gregg, Hall of Fame, nine-time Pro Bowler, six-time All-Pro, Super Bowl champion. Now, for our other tackle spot, we gotta go with a guy who was as mean and nasty as they come. Larry Allen, an 11-time Pro Bowler, a seven-time All-Pro, a Super Bowl champion, and Hall of Famer. Now let's move on to the defense, starting with the defensive end position. Ed Too Tall Jones was six foot nine, a three-time Super Bowl champion, a three-time Pro Bowler, known for his incredible size, strength, and athleticism. All right, 
We need another defensive end for this All-Texas team, and we're going with a guy who was a sack machine in his day. Harvey Martin, a four-time Pro Bowler, co-MVP of Super Bowl XII, known for his relentless motor. Now let's move to the heart of the defensive line, the defensive tackle position. Chad Hennings was a three-time Super Bowl champion, known for his strength, toughness, and ability to clog up the middle. All right, we need another defensive tackle, and we're going with a guy who was nicknamed the Manster for a reason. Randy White, a nine-time Pro Bowler, seven-time All-Pro, Super Bowl champion, and Hall of Famer. Now, let's move on to the linebackers, and we gotta start with a guy who was a tackling machine for the Cowboys. Datton Guin. Guin was born in Vietnam but grew up in Texas, played his college ball at Texas A&M, and became a fan favorite in Dallas. All right, we need another linebacker for this all-Texas team, and we're going with a guy who was known for his hard-hitting style of play. Robert Jones, a three-time Super Bowl champion, a one-time Pro Bowler. Now, for our final linebacker spot, we gotta go with a guy who was as flamboyant as he was talented. Thomas Hollywood Henderson, a two-time Super Bowl champion, a one-time Pro Bowler, known for his trash-talking and incredible play. Now, let's move on to the secondary, starting with the cornerback position. Dion Primetime Sanders was a shutdown cornerback, a dangerous return man, and even played some wide receiver, an eight-time Pro Bowler, six-time All-Pro, two-time Super Bowl champion, and Hall of Famer. All right, we need another cornerback, and we're going with a guy who was a ball hawk for the Cowboys. Terrence Newman, a two-time pro bowler, known for his coverage skills and ability to make big plays. Now let's move on to the safety position, and we gotta start with a guy who was as feared a hitter as there was in the league. Darren Woodson, a three-time Super Bowl champion, five-time pro bowler, four-time all-pro. All right, we need another safety for this all-Texas team, and we're going with a guy who was a ball hawk in the Cowboys' secondary, Roy Williams, a five-time Pro Bowler, three-time All-Pro. Now, let's talk about the kicker position, and we gotta go with a guy who was as automatic as they come, Dan Bailey. Bailey was a one-time Pro Bowler, known for his accuracy and clutch kicking. Now, let's move on to the punter position. Matt McBriar was a one-time pro bowler, known for his strong leg and ability to pin opponents deep. Now let's talk about the return game, and we gotta start with a guy who was electric with the ball in his hands. Bob Hayes. Hayes was inducted into the Hall of Fame in 2009, considered one of the greatest return men in NFL history. And finally, folks, we gotta round out this all-Texas team with a punt returner. Who better than primetime Deion Sanders? The man was electric. He could turn a simple punt return into a house call in the blink of an eye. Sanders was a threat to score every time he touched the ball, a true game-changer in the return game. So, there you have it, folks. The excitement, the passion, the legacy. The all-time Texas team for the Dallas Cowboys. A team that has captured the hearts of millions. A squad loaded with Hall of Famers, Super Bowl champions, pro bowlers, and legends who have defined the game. These are some of the most talented players to ever wear the star, showcasing their skills and dedication. From Tom Landry on the sidelines, guiding the team with his wisdom and strategy, to Deion Sanders on the field, electrifying fans with his incredible plays, this team is stacked with talent. These Texas legends left an indelible mark on the Cowboys organization, creating unforgettable moments and memories. Their contributions to the team's storied history will never be forgotten, and their legacy will continue to inspire future generations of Cowboys fans